What's good, my people? This is the general, Mr. Mills, the pro money geek himself. This is the beginning of 2021, and I wanted to get it jumping off right in a consistent way and let you guys know the first thing that you have to do um, in starting any business, any venture, any idea is believing in yourself. But with that, you want to make sure that you actually apply action. Okay, you have to invest into yourself, whether it's learning, getting the resources, the tools, you know, you don't have to have a lot um, to start, but you need to have the drive to do so. So if you look, if you're looking around right now, um, you see different pieces of equipment um, all around me, even things that you can't see. This was just an investment into myself. Um, because I need a release, a creative release. This is just for me. Um, some people play sports. Some people work out. Some people do different things to relieve stress. For me, I like to create music. I like to hear sound. I like to just create things, even if outside of audio. I'm a creative spirit, a creative soul. So I like to entreat others and express myself at the same time. I like to leave others better than what they were before they met me all right um after they met me to be in a better position so um enough with that so back to the track uh make sure that you guys every day the night before write down your next day's goals um but reference my previous video that shows you how to um, create long-term goals, uh, create a, a long-term goal sheet, like a spreadsheet for all of your big time goals. That's going to take a lot of time and effort. And then from there, you want to create your short-term goals list. And those are going to be all of the goals that you would need to do in order to achieve the long-term goals. And then after you do the short-term goals, then you begin to construct your daily schedule. By doing your daily schedule, it helps you to become um, more proficient, um, more organized. And not only that, but you'll become more confident because as you see those blocks get knocked down, all of those hurdles that seemed like hurdles in the beginning, but all it is is things that you need to do in order to realize what you see in your mind. To bring it forth into this realm, you know, so you can summon it by action, activity, you know, consistency. That's how we do that. That's what we preach here on this Pro Money Geeks channel. All right. So these are just tidbits, tips, things for you that you need to know, things that you need to implement into your life. I can only be an example. I have many things I've accomplished a lot and I will be showing you little assets or different things throughout my journey guys be sure every day to get something accomplished to check it off it's easy to become lax it's easy to get sidetracked and put your attention elsewhere be sure to stay tunnel vision and, and get everything that you need accomplished also reference back um to one of my previous videos and then look at my uh, starting my my starting cost for my current uh, stream of income that I'm just building called Accurate Help is for my loan signing um, agency. Um, I'm a loan signing agent, obviously, um, and I've pretty much went down that path of getting everything ahead of time because I projected in my mind if I'm able to do at the minimum seventy five dollar jobs, um, and say if I spent a total of thirty five hundred dollars, for example. Then if it's thirty five hundred dollars, let me do the math just to give you guys a better insight to where I am. So say if I spent thirty five hundred, that's divided by seventy five. That means I need to get forty six, nearly forty seven loan uh, signings before I break even. So for forty seven, I project that would take anywhere between one to two months. I don't mind the delayed gratification in this um, aspect because I'm gaining um, traction and I'm gaining experience. 
the the ins and outs of working with signing agencies but then i'm going to begin like i've said previously start outsourcing to or direct marketing to title companies or escrow officers different lenders things like that and then of course i cross promote my um, website uh, www.ahlsa.com is up um, I haven't promoted it or anything like that. It's fully functional. I had to make sure all of the functionalities were working correctly. So those are fine. I'm happy about that uh, for sure. And then I've started promoting or creating the social media profiles for the business. I'll be jumping on that today. Honestly, actually, I just passed my notary essentials or just completed the notary essentials portion of the training from the nna um i have passed the exam i have um got the notary supplies i have my eno insurance um the hundred thousand dollar one i obtained that one and my background check everything came through pretty much on december 31st so i can start off a fresh brand new of course i'll be showing you videos giving you content um as i'm getting signings to and from just so you can see um i don't suspect that it's a hard thing because i like talking to people regardless and i like educating people so as soon as i have a foundation or a grasp on something then i enjoy doing it especially if i'm gonna get paid much more than i would from a nine to five right now i'm still working a nine to five um, it pretty much takes up the bulk of my day because I start in the morning. I don't get off until late afternoon. Um, so what I'm going to start doing, my strategy is to maybe apply a few signings in the morning, start at five or so to seven, just a two hour window. And then I do those somewhere close to my home. That way, if I can get one done before I actually start work, that's great too. And then when I'm off, I'll schedule between seven and 11 you know four hours that give me time to at least do one to two uh and depending on how close it could be three you know but if i can do that per day and build up my consistency to where where my income either matches or exceeds what my nine to five is then of course i'm gonna let that one go so that's just to give you a little insight on um this journey this accurate help journey and once again i'm mr mills make sure you subscribe make sure you hit the notification button Make sure you hit the thumbs up, that like button, and share it. You know, come back. I appreciate you coming back, first and foremost. And I appreciate that you found value in this content, which is why you're back in the first place. I wouldn't stare you wrong. I can't stare you wrong if I'm staring myself, because I want to lead by example, right? All right. So, other than that, I do thank you guys for tuning in to the Pro Money Geeks channel. Once again, I'm Mr. Mills, the general Pro Money Geek. Appreciate it. You guys have a good one.